although there aren't that many days left in 2020, you just have to remember each and every single day is an opportunity to try something new, and that's what I'ma do today. So I'd like to humbly welcome you to Vlogmas Day 1. So this year I'm jumping on the bandwagon. Look at me being productive. Uh, and I'm going to be uploading a video every day from the 20th until the 25th, so that is six super festively themed videos for just you guys. So without further ado, let's jump into the first video. So for the last couple years I've helped people put up their trees and I've helped them decorate their homes but like I haven't done it myself per se so um I got some decorations in this hat so that the cat doesn't try and play with them uh, and the first thing out of the hat is my mistletoe. So it is just a painted pine cone with an old broom end on it uh, and it's just painted green. I'm gonna let you guys just like check out this ribbon, but uh, it actually has some hearts on it. It was meant to be for Valentine's Day, but you know, you'll work with what you got. Um, my thought for this is we have the light fixtures on the ceiling that are kind of like, they're like a dome shape with like the little nubbin on the end. I just want to know if you got a ceiling titty too, a ceiling titty too. This can just slip right onto the nubbin and just hang off one of the light fixtures. Um, I'll probably put this one in the living room. Next one we- oh, oh, this one's my favorite. Next one is my friend. So we have this little cute octopus friend. He's my favorite. I used to have him on my desk at work. Just- I think I actually had him there all year round. He's just cute. Like, you can't just put him away. Um, and I think I'll put him right on the bar, so when I walk in the door, I get to see him every day. <laughs> Next up, I have this. It has a um, cute little snowman on it, and like some snowflakes, and just has stuff inside it. There's no ribbon, there is no, nothing holding that up, so um, one sec. There is a thing in here with a ribbon or a string on it. So we have Mr. the snowman. Got a cute little snowman He Oh, missed a cute little snowman that only has one arm. That's good. Let me just check and make sure his arm isn't in the bag because if it is, then I can keep referring to this as my bag, by the way. It seems he no longer has an arm. That's okay. We don't judge. Put that on there. And then slide it down. And I might hang this off the light fixture in the kitchen. It's one of the ones that has um, like four lights and then a fan, but all the lights have like little um, screws in them and they hang out so I can just like hang it onto the, like, the screw and it won't go flying around with the fan. It's just on the light instead. Next, I have, <gasps> ooh, this is new. I'm gonna, so it stops rattling. I'll just take that off, but I got a festive cookie jar. Ooh, ASMR. So later this week for Vlogmas, I am going to be doing some baking, and now I have some goods to put in there. And this is a little lid. It has gold little bell embellishment. Very cute. I'm going to put this one on my kitchen counter. Now mind you, my place isn't very big, so I don't have that many decorations. Hear me out, and if it looks weird, that's fine. You're not in this house. I'm in this house. <laughs> I was going to put this on top of the fridge. It's not particularly clean. That's because it was already there um this was it, it eventually had flowers in it and then i took the flowers out because the flowers died i didn't buy any more because rona it's not necessary right now um and i figured i could just I'll put it on top of the fridge like that would that be cute can i do that maybe we'll do that i think that's what i'll do there's also extra string just hiding in there that are meant to go on all of the bulbs but i didn't use these ones on the trees so i didn't actually go ahead and do any of that but You'll see which ones I used eventually. I mean, tomorrow, but... <laughs> Lastly, I have this. And I think this is gorgeous. Let me show you the actual sparkly side. Yeah, there we go, that's better. I have no idea what to do with this. If you guys have like any suggestions as to what I could do with all of this, it's gorgeous, it's so sparkly. Um, it almost looks like it could be festive or I could keep it and use it in like the spring or summer. 
I was gonna put it on gifts. Like, I'm actually half decent at making, like, bows with these sort of things. If you think I should use it on gifts, let me know in the comments below. If you have any ideas for crafts with it, maybe, instead, let me know in the comments below. But now, I think I'm gonna go put these around the house and show you how I have them placed. So this is where I decided the mistletoe could go. That's just the light fixture right in the living room, so I figured that'd be a cute spot. Next I have my favorite decoration, and I'm just going to put him right there, right in the middle, so I get to see him every time I come in the door. The next one I have is our one-armed snowman, and our decoration that did not have a string. And these are the nubs I was talking about. Let's see if I can try not to throw these on the floor. There we go. Wow, that was graceful, wasn't it? At least I have a spot for it, that's not too bad. And that's just in the kitchen. Perfect. Next we have our cookie jar. Um, and you know, I'm gonna put it in the kitchen because that's that's where the that's where the cookies go. So hope you weren't expecting any surprises there. Lastly I have my giant vase full of bulbs with a Santa hat on it. Uh, I think I'll put it on top of the fridge. Um I can sort of reach the top of the fridge, so we'll just we'll just Yeet that up there. There we go. Yeah, that looks fine on a normal basis. I can't usually see the top of the fridge, so if it's a little off center, it's fine. Um, so I absolutely forgot that I have decorations outside, so that's where we're gonna go next. It's cold, um, so I'm just gonna do that quick. All right, I'm gonna make this real quick so I don't just look like a weird lady standing on her front porch talking to herself. Here's my wreath. This was given to me by my sister. It's all homemade and it's really cute. I keep getting a lot of compliments on it. That's supposed to be to hang up coats. Don't don't worry about that. And then there's my tree. This one also plugs in and it lights up. Um, I just have a Canadian flag on it because I had hanging pots with these in them and I was like, well, I might as well put one on top of the tree along with a cat toy because I didn't know what to do to top a tree when it's going outside. Yeah, so now that I'm all done putting up all the decorations, I'm getting a little bit hungry and I want to make something, you know, a little special, a little festive, but I don't want to work too hard on it, so I think we should make a charcuterie board. Charcuterie? Charcuterie. Char- The thing with the meat and the cheese and the nuts and the- can you drive any louder? The things with the meat and the cheese and the- <laughs> You heard it, it's fine, it's whatever. So this is what we got. Got some crackers. Le Michabou. Some Weisers, got some mixed nuts, some raspberries. I don't know, I, I like a little bit of fruit on my boards. Um, and this is, what is this, ham? Some honey ham and some spicy mustard. So I'm just gonna throw this all together real quick. Oh, also I have fancy knives, look at these. Aren't they cute? Oh, I love them. Just pretend like that one's there. I definitely, this isn't my second one this week. Don't worry about it. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna throw this all together and then give you guys a quick look as to how it is. Alrighty, and here it is all finished. You got your crackers and your cheese and your meats and just a little sippy sippy to go with it.
So that brings us to the end of Vlogmas Day 1. I hope you guys enjoyed yourself. As always, if you did, feel free to give me a like down below and you can subscribe if you want. If you have any suggestions at all, please leave a comment and I will see you guys tomorrow. Oh my god, I'm so used to saying next week. Merry Chrysler!